Thank you, Greg, for joining us today. What is Vans bringing to Oshkosh 2021? Uh, we have almost all the airplanes in our fleet. We have the 14 and the 14A. We have a RV-12 IS, a SLSA special light sport airplane, the four-seat RV-10. Uh, we have a customer that brought an RV-8. We have an RV-9A. Out on the demo line, we have the 7A and another 14A. And uh, we have a whole bunch of airplanes that we brought with us. So pretty much representative of, of the entire current line of kits that people can buy from us and then build in their garage or basement or hangar and then end up flying themselves. You do have quite the fleet that we're looking at. Are there going to be any additions to that fleet in coming months? On Monday, we had our what's, ha what's new and happening Advanced Aircraft Forum. And in that, we did sort of let the cat out of the bag or open the curtain a little bit. Uh, to tell people about the RV-15, which is the next model coming from Vans Aircraft. Uh, what we've announced to date is that it will be a high-wing, all-metal, backcountry-capable airplane. Uh, the initial version will be a tailwheel uh, with a tricycle version to follow. Uh, it will have a control stick, not a yoke. So, so those are some of the things that we have said. Uh, and we're super excited about it. Um, it's, uh, I'm, I'm really looking forward to building one, I can tell you that, and flying it. It's actually really unusual for Vans to announce anything before it's completely done. Mm -hmm. So this is the first time we've done this. We've had a number of questions from customers over the last few years about what are you doing next and, you know, do you think you might ever do a backcountry style airplane? And that's been our plan to do that for a number of years. And so uh, we just decided that it was time to, to let uh, folks out there know that that's the direction that we're heading in. Uh, our uh, President and Chief Engineer Ryan Johnson at the forum on Monday did say that you know it's our goal and intent is to have the prototype airplane here at Oshkosh next year right. so that people will be able to see that and take a look at it. So we're pretty darn excited about that. Looking at the line of Vans aircraft behind us, there are a lot of similarities between different models. Is the RV-15 going to be similar to others? I mean there are certain characteristics of all RVs. We use the term total performance. Um, to talk about the way that it feels when it flies, and that's very important to us, um, the, the performance on the top end and the low end. Uh, but from the perspective of the, the new airplane model, it's really primarily clean sheet design. So, you know, we're not, people have suggested, well, you could just take an RV-9 airfoil and put it on top of an RV-9 and you'd have a high-wing airplane. It really doesn't work that way. Uh, so there's uh, essentially all new design going into this. Of course, we're taking what we know from our extensive experience with, you know, just about 11,000 flying airplanes right now, RVs out there. So we have a lot of great input and experience from the community and knowing the airplanes. But the RV-15, will be, it'll be a different airplane, but it will include those characteristics that make an RV an RV. The Zephyr is what you have always wanted. A highly capable two-seat turbine-powered helicopter with great ramp appeal, 100 mile per hour cruise speed, 172 nautical mile range, and to top it all off, a first of its kind emergency airframe parachute system, the Curdy Design Zephyr. Unique, advanced, innovative, and highly capable. Your ultimate freedom machine is available now at zephyr.eu.